Hi dear, today we will start with the chapter 13, Magnetic Effects of Electric Current. Okay, so already we have uh, learned about the heating effect of uh, electric current in the previous chapter, right? Likewise, here we are going to study about the magnetic effects of electric current. Okay, uh, first we will start with what is magnet. Okay, first we will learn about the magnet, then we will go for the magnetic effects of electric current. Okay, magnet. What is mean by magnet? An object which shows the properties, everyone knows, right, magnet which will attract, attract the small piece of iron, right. An object which shows the properties of attracting small piece of iron towards us. Usually we will know about the only iron. It can attract nickel, cobalt, some, uh, some other things also, okay. So, attracting small piece of iron towards it, okay. And always when it is suspended freely, it will rest in north-south direction, okay. When it is suspended freely, it will always rest in the north-south direction, okay. This is called magnet, okay. Uh, uh, so, what does mean by magnetism? If any object possesses this, possess all this uh, thing, okay, that property is, we call it as magnetism, okay. The property by virtue of which a magnet attracts small piece of iron, nickel, cobalt, etc. and rests in north-south direction when suspended freely is called magnetism, okay. Next, so what are the uses of magnetism? Why we have to study about this magnets and its properties, okay? Because it is widely used in many areas, okay? Magnets are used in uh, radio and stereo speaker, refrigerated doors, audio and video cassette players, hard disk and floppy disk of computer, children toys and magnetic compass, okay? In various fields, its purpose may be a differ, okay? In radio and speaker, stereo speaker, because of the magnetic effect, a sound vibration will be produced okay whatever the electrical signals it is getting it will be converted into sound vibration okay because of the magnetic field okay in the refrigerated doors it is used to close the door tightly okay it will not open right uh, it, it can hold uh, close the door tightly okay in audio and video cassette, it is used as a recording thing, okay. This magnetic effect helps in um, use for recording the uh, show and uh, we can uh, broadcast it again, okay. And then hard disk and floppies of computers. Usually people don't know, uh, don't know about this hard disk and floppies. In the old, uh, in a few back years, we used to have this floppies, hard disk and all, okay, hard disk, okay. Uh, that they are used for the storage purpose okay storage purpose in children toys and and also magnetic compass you will know uh, the needle is used actually the compass needle itself is a small magnet only okay and in children toys usually the children toys will be made up of uh, plastic things right uh, to get that shape uh, uh, the magnets will be attached to that okay so that it easily stick together and it forms a shape okay so in children toys also use uh, magnets are used okay who found this magnetic effect and when okay hans christian oyster okay born in 1777 and lived up to 1851 he was a leading scientist of the 19th century at the 19th century he was the one of the leading scientists okay he played an important role in electromagnetism okay in 1820, he accidentally discovered this one, this uh, mag uh, electromagnetic effect, okay. He accidentally discovered that a compass needle got deflected when an electric current passed through a metallic wire placed nearby, okay. Uh, he found that uh, mag magnetic, uh, I mean, compass needle is deflecting, okay, when it is kept near the current carrying metallic wire, okay, current carrying metallic wire. His research helped in creating the technologies such as radio, television and fiber optics, okay. Uh, so, to honor him, a uh, unit of magnetic field strength is given as Oyster, okay. Oyster, okay. The unit of magnetic field strength, okay. It is given as Oyster to honor him, okay. So, we will see some of the facts about the compass needle also, compass needle, okay. He found that the uh, compass needle is deflected, right? When the current carrying wire is uh, kept near the metallic wire. Current carrying metallic wire is placed near that, okay? 
So what is mean by this compass needle? We will see some of the facts we know that but still some of the facts we should uh, recollect that. Okay. Facts about the compass needle. Compass needle gets deflected when brought near a bar magnet. Okay. When the compass needle is, no, compass will be like that. Usually, usually it will be like that or it can be like that also in the bar magnet uh, a needle will be placed okay when it is brought nearer to this uh, magnet it will be deflected like this moving here and there okay compass needle get deflected when brought near a magnet bar okay a compass needle itself is a small bar magnet okay we are considering that a, a needle itself is made up of a magnet okay it is a it is it is considered as a small bar magnet the ends of the compass needle point approximately towards north and south direction when it, uh, we have studied just now we have studied right when it suspended freely it will rest in north south direction okay the magnets will rest in uh, north south direction likewise we are considering the needle also as a small bar magnet right so when it is suspended freely or kept in rest it will always rest in the north south direction okay it will it is always point towards the north and south direction okay the ends of the compass needle point approximately towards the north and south direction the end pointing towards the south is called south seeking or south pole you can call it as south seeking or south pole okay the end pointing towards the north is called north seeking or north pole okay uh, by so many observation it was found that we also uh, while playing we would have found that light poles repels each other okay if if you bought this uh, if you if you bought this uh, north north there uh, north pole as well as one more north pole um, magnet then it will be deflected it will be move away from each other it will not attract it will move away from each other okay if you bought this north and south pole then it will stick together it will attract each other okay by by many observation it was found that light poles repel each other uh, light poles repel each other and unlike poles of the magnets attract each other okay attract each other unlike poles means north and south and light poles means north north or south south okay if you bought north north it will repel each other it will move away from each other when it is south south it will also repel each other move away from the each other when you bought the north and south pole together it will attract each other okay thank you